How much impact are you actually making if you're committing time into certain tasks right here today? You may have freed up some time to be able to spend two hours on yourself, on your business, but how much impact are you actually making in that two hours? How much work are you actually doing in that two hours? And more importantly, how much is that work benefiting you? Now, if there's one mistake I've actually made in the last three or four months that's probably affected me the most, actually, it would be this one. And the reason for making this video is that I really want you to listen to the message in this video. And if you are in the same position as me, I want you to learn from my mistakes and I want you to move forward and follow a bit of my lead and make the relevant changes that you need to, just as I have. The mistake in question. Obviously, we all have different goals to achieve in life. Now, to achieve these goals, to spend time on yourself, to spend time on achieving such things, you need to free up time, which luckily I've been able to do. I free up one or two hours a day to be able to spend on my business, on myself. And the fantastic part of that is that I'm in a position now that I can do that. I actually still have a nine to five job. I do have family commitments. We will literally in the next week or so have a little baby in our arms as well. So that will definitely add to my list of commitments. But more to the point, when all of these things are going around us, when we do have this one or two hours to spend on our business, on our lives, it's really important to make sure that those hours that you do put in are really impactful and not wasted. Now, I can make a video today for you guys to tell you about how you should eliminate distractions, you should set extra targeted goals, you should really dig in deep, you should get focused. But there's a million videos out there that's gonna tell you that anyway. And there are videos on my channel that will indeed tell you such things. But this video I really want to talk to you about making sure that you are spending your time wisely and focusing in the right areas on what makes the most impact. And the reason again for making this is because I've made this one mistake which I want to share. Now, I'm actually going to show you, I've got it right here, but I will uh, actually put a picture of it up on the screen now. These are my three goals at the moment, my three projects, let's say, that I have on at the moment. One is obviously for me, just personal. Number three is a personal one for me to improve my health, to improve my fitness, and also to improve my family life to make sure that I'm getting quality for me and my family. And number two is actually sharing content with you guys and making sure that I'm actually giving value back. I, I'm a very fond believer of you get what you give. And number one here as well is to actually quit my job and actually provide income through different sources. As I was touching on here, focusing on the right goals at the right time is important. And actually writing this down has really opened my eyes to the mistake that I made here. So maybe doing this exercise for yourself might be a good idea too. Maybe if you haven't literally written them down on a piece of paper for a while. But I have focused so much on spending time doing, especially when I've only got an hour or two a day, I've spent so much time either interacting on Facebook, trying to help other people. And of course that has been a benefit. That is not a negative. It is not a negative that I've spent the time on the areas that I have. There are other things that I have been doing, but I haven't been spending as much time as I would have liked on actually trying to again, develop my advertising, to be able to earn income, to earn revenue, to in turn, quit my nine to five job. Now, again, doing this exercise has really brought its light for me, but the more I think about it, the more I'm actually quite upset by this, because in all honesty, if anything on that list is more important than anything else, which I don't believe they are, they're all equally important to me at this very moment in time, but something that is, as I say, just as important as being able to talk to you and communicate with you through these videos is actually replacing that income for me. Not just for the sake of I want to make more money, but the purpose for me to replace my income is so I can quit that nine to five job, get more time freedom and more financial and geographical freedom, but most importantly, more time freedom to free myself up 
to spend on these other tasks. That doesn't mean I want to spend 100% of my time on that number one goal because you've got to have a balance. Of course you have. But my balance was literally spending pretty much 50% on both of the other tasks. But now that I've done this, I've refocused. And again, the reason for making this video and explaining this mistake I've made is because I really want you to have a look at the tasks that you are doing right now. If you, like me, have freed a couple of hours a day, you may be spending those hours on your business and you may be really happy with yourself, as I was, that you've freed up this time and you're spending time on your business and that's gotta be fantastic. But what do you actually do in those couple of hours? Making videos is great. And writing on Facebook, maybe you're, maybe you're writing articles, is fantastic and it's making an impact, of course it is. And it's making an impact to others, that's a definite. But have you actually got that balance? Are you actually focusing on all the right things? Are you being really impactful with those couple of hours? Are you doing things now that will benefit you in the future? And again, me right now, having a balance, having a healthy balance and focusing also on replacing that income is really gonna benefit me in the future. But sometimes you do just need to spend some time on yourself and realize, yep, I need to have a balance here. But more importantly, I need to refocus and make the most out of those two hours. It's not the hours you spend, it's the work that you do and it's the progress you make in those hours. I want to say thank you for listening to this message and if you really did enjoy this video and you have any insights to share please use that comment section below and share all of your thoughts as I know a lot of other people who watch these videos actually do benefit from reading your comments also. But if you do want to see more videos like this from me and you want to see more mindset, personal development goals maybe, then definitely make sure you subscribe as I upload regular content onto this channel. But make sure, guys, you do take away the message that was in this video and definitely think about it for yourself. But until next time, guys, that's all for me. So bye for now.